Hey everyone, Renee here and I'm doing a skincare routine video for you guys today because I've been getting a lot of requests uh, in regards to what I use on a daily basis. So let's jump right into some of the products. So first product I want to talk about is a makeup wipe and this is what I use to take off all my makeup uh, before I go to bed. Um, it's actually what I use before I cleanse my skin. So these are the Yes to Cucumber makeup wipes. These are 98% natural. This creates a natural glow. And it basically is uh, blended with organic cucumber, aloe vera, and dead sea minerals. So I just take this, wipe all my makeup off. It even takes off mascara and eyeliner. Um, and then I go into my cleanser. After I do that, I cleanse my skin. And since about December, I've been using the Philosophy Purity One Step Facial Cleanser. As you can see, it's almost gone. <laughs> Um, I do love this. This smells like a spa in a bottle. The only thing that is my concern is that um, it does contain parabens. Let's see if I can find mm, the actual ingredient. I don't know if I'll be able to... Yeah, it, it's the methyl paraben, propyl paraben. <laughs> Very scientific here, you guys. But it does contain that. Um, and as you guys know, parabens aren't the best for you because um, research has shown that it can elude and cause some cancers. Now, I'm not a doctor, um, but I try to stay away from that stuff um, because it is your skin. It's your largest organ on your body. So uh, I don't know if I'll be repurchasing this, but as far as my skin goes, the way it looks and feels, that cleanser has done a pretty good job. The kind of tag team um, best friend to that product is the uh, Micro Delivery Exfoliating Wash. It looks like this. Uh, I got this in a kit, obviously, around Christmas time, so that's why these bottles are a little bit smaller. This is a four ounce bottle, but this is a Micro Massage Exfoliating Wash. And so at night, after I take the Purity Cleanser, you know, that gets all my makeup off, I'll take this and take a little dime size and just exfoliate for 30 seconds. I like something that is foamy, but it also, you know, has a little bit of texture, so I feel like I'm really getting into my pores and taking care of, you know, what's going on there. After I cleanse my skin, this is another product that I started using in December, and this is the Lancome Genifique. You guys have seen this in some of my favorites videos. This is um, a youth activating concentrate. Now, a concentrate is an oil or water based serum and it just adds extra hydration to your skin um, and this one is specifically formulated to add that youthfulness back. So after your skin is completely cleansed you just take a little like one pump of it um, it's like a dime size and you just spread it on your fingers and I just like to pat it all over my skin. You do it a.m. and p.m. Um, but because you're using such a little amount, this thing will last you four to five months, maybe even six months. Um, and this one is another kind of high ticket item, but it definitely is worth the investment. I mean, you can't really skimp on your skin, right? So that's at night, and after I take the micro uh, delivery exfoliating wash, then it's time to moisturize. <laughs> this is probably the key to anything. Um, and I was always kind of afraid of moisturizers when I was younger because I thought that added moisture was, you know, adding oil to my skin and therefore breaking me out. Because let me just preface you guys, my skin is, I have no makeup on right now. I have a little bit of lip gloss um, and some mascara from earlier this morning. But my skin is not perfect. And the people that have perfect skin, amen to you. But you know, as far as I go, this is kind of a normal normal thing for me is dealing with skin issues and it's whether or not it's a hormonal little breakout or it's a breakout because I'm sweating too much or there's a certain product that I'm using. Um, so yeah, so I think just skin in general, it's a very touchy subject because everybody's different. These products work for me, they may not work for you, but it's worth giving some a try because it's kind of a trial and error thing. I do have to say that don't really go crazy with experimenting every week. If something isn't working, yes, you'll know right away, but your skin is a living organ and it might take something, you know, a little bit longer than a week to really see results. So there's my rant. I'll get off my soapbox and move on to moisturizers. 
So yes, moisturizing is very important. And as I get older, now I know that moisturizers are the key to having that youthful kind of glow. You know, my go-to is the Ultra Calming Aveeno Daily Moisturizer. This also has an SPF, and I believe it's 30, which is great. And this is fragrance-free. I try to stay away from a lot of dyes, and fragrance-free um, products usually are great. Um, so this is the calming version. So it kind of calms down any redness or or any sort of um, discoloration in your skin. Another moisturizer that I love, and this one, you guys, it will change your life. I heard about it from a friend of mine who happens to be an esthetician. Um, you've probably heard about it on YouTube, but this will change your world. <laughs> this is the Origins Vitazine SPF 15 Energy Boosting Moisturizer with Mangosteen. Okay, now if you don't know what mangosteen is, I had to Google it too. Mangosteen is an antioxidant. It comes from a berry that grows on an evergreen tree. But basically, that's fancy schmancy stuff. It's basically just an antioxidant. So along with that formula of the mangosteen, they attach vitamin C, vitamin E, and those are all great antioxidants um, to help your, your skin stay and remain youthful. The thing about this stuff, you guys, though, and I know, okay, this is 1.7 fluid ounces, but this stuff will absolutely change your life. I'm not even kidding. It has these specks in it, and I don't, you won't even be able to see it on camera, but it's a, it's a lighter, and I don't want to waste any, um, because this stuff is $35, but it's definitely worth it. Um, so it's a, it's a cream. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but there's little kind of tan specks in it. It looks like um, a little bit of like a coffee color. Fingers, it spreads those out and it just kind of melts into your skin tone and it almost works as like a, as a foundation. I know that sounds crazy, but I know because it's kind of a, it's just a moisturizer, but it's better than a tinted moisturizer. I wear this as a foundation sometimes, you guys. <laughs> um, but not only that, it's energizing and it makes your skin feel amazing. Origins products are formulated with natural and certified organic ingredients and 100% natural essential oils. They're formulated without parabens, so that's what I was talking about. Um, mineral oil, PABA, petroleum, paraffin, DEA, um, and animal ingredients, so that's kind of cool. And they also manufacture using a combination of renewal resources, wind energy, and earth-friendly practices. So that's why this puppy is $35 a container because they're putting in the effort, yo. But this, if out of any of this stuff, I would try this because it will it will change your world. Um, a lot of people say to put on an eye cream before your moisturizer and I've been doing kind of changing up just to see what I like. Um, so I've been doing the moisturizer and then the eye cream and I've been, I haven't found an eye cream that I absolutely love. So if you guys have one that you use and you recommend, send it my way. I've been getting these little travel things um, from either Sephora or just random places. This one is the Amore Pacific. I've never heard of that brand. Um, it's just a little packet moisturizing eye gel. So it's paraben free, which is very important. I've really liked this. I've like really skimped on it and you really only need a little bit. Uh, and I've you I've had this open for like a week now. Always important to protect your lips. SPF anytime you can on your lips, but you also um, sometimes you want to have a little bit of gloss. You don't always just want to be slathering up some some chapstick. A good one that I use when I'm out at the beach or running or um, working out is just a, a Burt's Bees uh, lip balm. It's 100% natural. Really a really good easy one to just to swipe on before you go out and work out. Um, if you want to go to the beach and still look like you're kind of wearing makeup or you're at the pool, Neutrogena Moisture Shine Lip Soothers. I'm, you guys have seen these in my videos from way back. Um, and these are great. This has, uh, this is in Glimmer 15 and this is SPF 20. So I really love these in the summertime. And the last product and ingredient and anything that I, that would help with uh, your skincare routine is to remember to drink plenty of water. I try to drink two liters a day. You know, um, it's natural. <laughs> it quenches your thirst. Imagine that. So that would be the, the number one um, recommended tip that I would give you for, for healthy skin. I hope this helps you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.